We all know Christian movies can be pretty corny. Hey, Scotty. Jesus, man. <laughs> it's clear there is much room for improvement. However, there are faith-based movies out there that are not cheesy and actually are kind of bold and edgy with their content. I like to call these films Bold Faith Films or BFF. I don't get it. Some examples would be The Lord of the Rings, The Book of Eli, Signs, Ben-Hur, pretty much any movie directed by this guy, and of course, recently, The Sound of Freedom. Whether it's their brutal violence, dark subject matters, or just their horrific visuals, these films do contain some very bold content to help illustrate themes about faith and God. Too often, we see Christian movies try to plug the message of the gospel directly to the audience. And although I understand the impulse, because that's what we are called to do as Christians, nobody Nobody wants to watch a movie to hear a lecture or a sermon. Nobody! It's no different than when a Hollywood movie virtue signals to us their secular ideas. Instead, what I think these BFF movies do very effectively is not present faith in God as a form of propaganda, but rather what they do is present it as a subtextual theme. Every movie has ideas and themes it's presenting to an audience, but it's all about how it's presented. For example, The Lord of the Rings never mentions Christ, the Bible, or anything about God, yet it strongly implies very Christian themes. And sure, if a film never mentions faith or God, you can interpret a movie's themes to not mean anything Christian, but that's not the point. The point is that we need faith-based movies to be bold. You must be bold. Jerry. We need to tell better stories that are not afraid of showing content that is sometimes dark or disturbing that conveys a truth. Without it, we lose a sense of authenticity in our storytelling. As Christian filmmakers, our goal has and always should have been to make the movie entertaining first. It's not the job of a movie to convert anybody to Christianity, but rather it's to create a compelling narrative that connects them back to God and our faith. This is the way. And by no means am I saying that you can't enjoy a family-friendly movie that wears its love for Jesus on its sleeve, but I think we need more of these bold faith films in our society. We know that movies have a major influence on our culture, and it's clear there is a growing disconnect between what Hollywood is producing and what audiences actually want. There's enough box office receipts already that prove that audiences want more faith-based movies to be bold. Now, can films centered around faith go too far with the content and completely undermine the Christian message? You betcha! Can movies also completely misrepresent the tenets of the Christian faith? Of course! We've seen it happen many times, and both filmmakers and audiences should always discern moral judgment when it comes to engaging with any content. No, 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 go past this, past this part. In fact, never play this again. But the point is that showing dark and sometimes disturbing content can be a force for good. I mean, the Bible itself is full of very dark and disturbing stories and content, but it's not there to disturb you, it's there to illustrate the message of the gospel. Now, the good news is that there seems to be a growing community of production companies and studios out there that are already aimed at trying to do something like this. Angels studios in particular, Kingdom Story companies doing this, and even political websites like The Daily Wire seem to be focused on making bold faith films. And as a Christian filmmaker myself, these are the kinds of movies I want to make for an audience. I don't want to just tell stories, I want to tell stories that authentically illustrate the eternal importance of Christ, faith, and all that comes with it. Themes like love, sacrifice, trust, courage, and hope. These kinds of themes can be presented in any genre, but the key is to be bold in how we tell these stories, just like we are being told to be bold in our faith. Now, most of my movies already convey these kinds of themes, albeit not always perfectly. You're still only human. But as I continue to make more movies, I'm just here to say that I want to improve the quality of my storytelling as well, which means it's time to be bold. So if you would like to help me in this journey of making more bold faith films, I would appreciate it if you liked and subscribed so that we can help build this thing together. Thanks for watching, and until next time, God bless, Godspeed.